family, friends, and YouTube. Today, I'm going to do a double protection process. I'm going to put these radiator covers uh, on to protect from debris uh, flying in and hitting in my radiator, puncturing a hole. It's more cosmetic than anything else, but this would work to prevent rocks or gravel or whatever flies up from the road. But I'm also putting on the, or I have already put on the uh, foot air deflectors, which I can basically call them the foot guards because it will protect you from debris, uh, road, rain, things of that nature traveling at high speeds. So I already added those. I'll show those in a moment and I'm going to do the install of these now. All right, this came uh, directly out of a, just a regular cardboard box. This is how it was taped up. Looks like this is the instructions with some, looks like some plastic uh, snaps. Of course, with all panicle products, you get the uh, lanyard. And let's open it up. So the wrap, bubble wrap. These are the uh, guards for the uh, radiator. I want it all black. In case you can't tell, I, I like to black out everything. This is what they look like. And there's the instructions here. So that is the actual unboxing. Let's move on to the next phase. As you can see, this is the before. And there's not going to be a lot of places to remove the cameras, so I plan on taking all of this debris off of the coil, all these dead bugs and everything off the coils. Clean the coils a little bit and then I will put the guards on. There's not a lot of room to uh, maneuver a camera around. So I'm going to put these on and then come back and show you what they look like after they're on. All right, as you can see, here's the after. It was really a simple install because you're going to remove these two push pins. And like you can't see them, but they're right here on the side. You're going to remove those two push pins, put insert the guard, pull it forward, snap the two uh, replacement push pins in, and it's in place. And as you can see, it did darken everything in there. I don't think it's going to stop me from getting the bugs, but it will stop debris or gravel or anything else from flying up there and hitting the radiator. And I guess that's the overall goal. As you can see here, right in front of the brake is the air deflectors for your feet, but they're pretty thick. It's pretty thick uh, plastic or, you know, fiberglass and I think it'll do a good job of preventing road debris from hitting my feet and in the winter time or the cooler temperatures keeping the cool air off my toes but the only drawback that I see about these is you order it in smoke you would think that your two screws up front would be black but these are chrome but other than that uh, I can only tell you how well they work uh, as I travel in the in the winter time or when the road debris flies up. I know they're very thick and they're very sturdy. It's so, that's, that's some pretty solid stuff there. 
All right, the installation is complete. And uh, as you've seen from the radiator guards, again, it's kind of a cosmetic, but they are made of a thicker aluminum, so they will deflect gravel, rocks, or anything like that flying up. So I can't tell you over right now how they'll do. Only time will tell. They were easy to install. It takes less than two minutes to install. The, uh, the front, uh, the foot uh, air guards, I'm gonna call them air deflectors, but they're more like guards. I won't know until the winter time whether or not those will pay off. But right now, uh, I don't mind the look. I just wish that the black smoke would come with black screws. To me, that's a no-brainer. But other than that, uh, they're both they're both pinnacle products, um, and I'm not endorsing any company. But uh, I like what I've seen so far. So until next time, just live your life.